What's going on everyone? Corbin TWGR. Out on a day hike today. I uh, thought I would check out more of Slate Canyon. I'm thinking there's some camp spots up there by this spring. Can't remember the name of the spring right now. Gorgeous day. It's pretty freaking warm. I am sweating bullets. I brought like a liter and a half of water. That's all I brought. There's no stream. I am going to a spring. They show a spring on the map back there. And of course, you know, you can see the pipe and hear the water, but you can't get to it. <clears throat> so it very well could be that way up here. Um, so I'm just kind of going easy on the water. Now this thing's exposed way steep and it's just hot. All right guys, so I'm just chilling out for a minute, cooling off. I am 2.41 miles. I've done 1,745 feet of elevation gain in an hour and 35 minutes. So two and a half miles in an hour and a half with 1,700 feet of elevation gain. That, my friends, is the Wasatch Mountains for you. They are steep, but they are beautiful. I'm just chilling out, like I said, relaxing, getting some water in me, and uh, we're gonna continue on up. By the way, it's called uh, Boardman, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see if I can find the phone here. So we are headed up there to Boardman Spring. And we're right there. So we're just gonna continue up the blue till we hit that cross trail right here. And then we're gonna hit up Boardman Spring. You can see there it flattens out uh, by the contour lines. So you see those contour lines there they get more spread out so I'm hoping that there's some camping because this is kind of recon for for a trip just a overnight or maybe tomorrow night up here uh, solo so I'm just kind of reconning and seeing what's available Finally got up high enough where there's a breeze 
blowing. So it's really nice just to relax and cool off a bit because it is smoking hot out here. So I'm definitely up higher in this canyon than I've ever been, which is pretty cool. I love it when a trail is all new. And man, I'll tell you what, it's getting gorgeous. I'm up in the pines now. And uh, I'm coming up to a, what, they say there's a trail up here on on Gia, but I don't know if that's the case. to a spring and it is actually open water can't really tell where it's coming from up above but oh so there's a big pipe pouring out right there tons of water and then it looks like we got a fresh spigot for me. All right there, I'm gonna get some cold water, people. Oh, this is wonderful. This water I have here is just hot from the hike. Uh, so I'm gonna replace it. And I'm going on the fact that this is coming right out of the pipe. I'm assuming it's tapped directly into the spring, so I shouldn't have any worries about bacteria or anything harmful. This should be fresh, filtered by Mother Nature water. And boy, it looks clean. Ice cold. Oh my gosh. All right, so we made it to Boardman Spring. Up here in Slate Canyon. This water, guys. Ah, freezing cold. Oh, and it's so cold and so nice. Ah, I'm gonna camel up while I'm here. Drink a lot of water, because I sweated big time coming up here. So I am currently at 3.35 miles. 
I've done 2,148 feet of ele elevation. I'm at 7,157 feet. And I have been hiking approximately 2 hours and 13 minutes. So that's not too bad. I'm glad there was a spring here because I wasn't, I really wasn't looking forward to drinking that warm water. Um, but you never know if you're gonna, if it's gonna be an open spring or if it's, you know, they piped it underground. Luckily, at least I know now that there's a spring up here. We don't have to carry very much water when I come up to camp. It's awesome. So, if y'all know what type of flower this is, it's a, it's a flower with leaves. Well, oh, I'm standing on a really unmanageable spot here. Sorry guys. So I don't know what this flower is. It's a flower that has leaves for petals. And I've never I've never seen these before. You guys know what the heck they are. Go ahead and tell me, because I'm not sure what they are. They're tall. Big leaves. I mean, that's a good three feet tall. And yeah, leaves for petals. This spring area, guys, is just fantastic. It is so lush and gorgeous up here. Got the chair, got a kickback, you know how that goes. The clouds have rolled in, so the sun's not out anymore. I got fresh mountain water. I think I'm gonna hike up a bit further from here just to kind of see what it's like. But this is probably gonna be pretty much the end of my hike. 